It's me, the one and only, the marvelous one, Michael. This is the Michael vs. Marvelous YouTube channel. If you want to, hit that subscribe button. And if you decide to, make sure you turn on that bell button so you can get notifications whenever I put out videos. You know, it's been a while since I've done a couple of these vlogs. You see the shirt, the babes on it, you know how it is. Uh, so, got the, uh, you know, red cup. What's in the red cup? You'll never know. Stop guessing. One day I'll tell. Mm. It ain't more to tell you that much. Uh, so, today episode is... I'm bringing out the funny side. So, I'll be, you know, I got the Michael vs. Marvelous YouTube channel in the description below. Pretty damn dope podcast. I might say it. I like it. Uh, it's pretty, it's pretty lit. So, I get a lot of emails. And sometimes they be a little too much that I don't want to say on camera because it might get me in a little bit of trouble. And I don't want to be fancy. You know, I got my grandma, I got my sister, I got some family members watching. But... Lately, I've been getting some funny ones. You know, I've been getting a couple, bunch of bunch of clowns. You feel what I said? A bunch of clowns. Which, you, if you if you go through and look at the the uh, my my podcast, I got a segment where I do the clown season. Waiting on clown season two. We're up to about about fifteen about fifteen hundred votes. But Marvelous versus the Ladies Volume Six. That's that's blowing them off the water. So in that episode, I think that'll probably be like. Episode 140. Episode 140 is going to be one of those because it's a big milestone. It'll be about like season. I don't know what season it'll be. How do we do episodes? Uh, so that's going to be one of those ones that's going to be a big one. So that's why I'm just letting people vote and let people see. But if I sat back and I said I would do it today, I would literally say Marvelous vs. Lady Volume 6 would be done with a couple of guest hosts. That'd be like a two segment. It'd be like a two segment deal where I do one segment with a woman. Then I do another one with another woman so I can get get to, you know what I'm saying? Get to and don't just be like, okay, I'm doing it by myself. Uh, so a couple dudes hit me up and I call them Bozo the Clowns. They hit me up and they be like, Marv, Mike, whatever the fuck you call yourself, excuse me, if you're under 13, exit. I don't make content for you. I don't make content for kids. I make content for teenagers and adults. We don't do that. We don't do that young stuff. So if you're under 13, go that way. Uh, so a bunch of bozo the clowns hit me up and be like, stop doing your podcast, eliminate your podcast, drop it. You're lame, you whack. And I'll be like, I appreciate you reaching out to the Michael vs. Marvelous YouTube channel or podcast. I get that. I appreciate that. Thank you for reaching out. I respond to all fans, anybody that come this way. Let me look at y'all again, YouTube. I respond to every email that someone say, either it's good or bad. So, I did Clown Season 1, and the, and I got it, I got after a couple of Bozo the Clowns, because when you come for me, uh, I've been in the gym lately, been uh, 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 pumping iron, you know what I'm saying? Feeling a little, feeling real marvelous. Mm. You know, so try your luck, run up, get done up. You know how that story goes. So a couple of guys reach out to me and a lot of them tell me their Instagram name. They tell me their whole life story. They tell me where I can go find them. Ignorant clowns. Cause I'm coming, I'm coming. Believe me, I'm coming. I'm coming. And when I come, I'm coming in a disrespectful way. Listen to me, YouTube. I'm coming in a disrespectful way because you approach me in a disrespectful way. You call me fat ass, you call me ugly, you call me lame, but your lady loved this. Headphones on, microphone on, sexy voice activate like what it do, that turns her on, she loves it. They loves it. You let me say it again. <clears throat> Headphones on. 
microphone up. Sexy voice activate like what it do. I'm your host and one and only the marvelous one. And that gets your girl going. Well, get your girls going. Because it's not just one bozo. It's a couple of them. And they like to, they like to come. So when they hit me up in my head, in my head, I'd be like, and we're off. So now I know it's time to go there. And I got my sister. I got people say, you shouldn't, you shouldn't approach it. I said, no, I should. And I'm going to give them what they want. Because they bozos, I'm going to clown them. So I go to people pages to see what their woman look like. Because if she's rocking with the Michael versus Marvelous podcast, I want to know what she looks like if her bozo the clown boyfriend slash husband slash whatever side thing boo thing whatever you want to call it has an issue with yours truly uh, uh, let me clear my throat uh, 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 uh. so i go check because nine times out of ten they're going to post their girl and i'm going to go see what she looks like because she has emailed me and she had said this, things that my voice make her do to herself when she are in the bath with her wine. That's neither here nor there. YouTube, that's not my problem. Um, I'm just doing what I love to do and that's talk. Um, so that's why I said, if you're under 13, get your ass out of here. Cause it's gonna get a little, it's gonna get a little bit X-rated. So she says that I turn her on and I make it moist down her water flow, splash, whatever you want to call it. I hit her back with, I'm flattered, thank you. Nothing else was said. So he hears her listening. I don't know why you women continue to do this to your men. It's listen to the Michael versus Marvelous podcast in front of your man. If he's not a fan, he's going to feel some type of way, especially if you're over there. Oh my God, he's so handsome. His voice is so sexy. I love his podcast. Oh my God, I'm a big fan. You are dangling, 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 dangling from my thing in front of your man. And you don't think that he's going to attack me because my email is right there. MarvelousMyers1 at gmail.com. I'm not running from nobody. It's there. So they... Oh, better yet, they'll come to the... they come to the Michael versus Marvelous podcast. <laughs> oh, boy. You know you gotta when you when you certain people ain't your friends, you gotta get the request. So they sent the they sent a request, but I'll just go right to it. Accept what's popping. Because like I said, I respond to everyone who respond to my podcast. I respond back. So a couple of them. You're lame, you're fat, your shit's wag, you weak, but your podcast weak as hell, ain't nothing you talk about. I'll hit them with this. Your girl must love what I'm doing. She must love it. And you're threatened. She must love what this big guy does. She loves this voice. She loves it all. And you're upset. Hey, is it cool if I check your Instagram out? I, I get a feel for what's going on. I get a feel, y'all. I get a feel. Can I check out your Instagram? Yeah, Negro, you can do whatever you want to do. Punk. Okay. Now, you know I have a podcast, right? You know I have a YouTuber, right? You know that I'm going to clown you, right? He said, I don't care. It's nothing you can clown me. I'm a real one all day. I'm fly. I dress better than you. Blase, blase. Okay. I'm going to go check it out. I said, I'm gonna send you a friend request and you better accept it. Send him a friend request. True story. He accepts it. Scrolling down, see his babe, smoking hot. Ching, ching. I said, I should be in her DMs, let alone, you know, but let me start for a different air. You know, scrolling down, scrolling down, scrolling down. I was like, oh, oh whoa, this is how he dress. Tall T by 4X, um, L, um, they live out in like Alabama somewhere, somewhere down south. Bro, it's 2020, it's not 2004, it's not 2005. I used to rock tower tees. 
and I ain't even that tall. I just rock the tall tees, the baggy shorts and all that. Let's do all that. You feel me? It's 2020. Um, I go check out the gear. You already know if you look at some of the videos that I showed off my shoe collection. It's pretty fire, fire, fire emoji. Not to toot my horn, not to be cocky, because I am a retired sneakerhead. But I'm coming back out of retirement. But if you are wearing retro Jordans, if you are wearing sh shoes converses with your shoes tied up, my dude, never, ever, ever, ever tell you just better than me. Because, bruh, just one of my retros alone costs more than every shoe you got. Then you swap your shoes and you says fire kicks. Not one retro's in there, bro. Um, no Nikes. Um, you're not swaggy. You got a bad girl, though. Whoo, she bad. She bad bitch. She bad. Be bad. Finding a frog here. Good God Almighty. But uh, that's neither here nor there. But I'm saying you got a fine girl. I never once let her DM. She slides in mine. She loves the show. Shout out to you. Thank you, baby girl, for always rocking with the show. I know you're going to see it. Here you go. So we're going to get away from that clown. That clown was neither the left. Now we got another one. He's in Las Vegas. He feels some type of way. He don't know me. I don't know him. This was his response. Fuck boy. Why you why are you in why are you emailing my woman? I feel some type of way because he constant he constantly listens to your weak ass podcast all the time when I'm around. Maybe because I'm a real one, he's giving you some. See, maybe it's because this. How about this? Have you ever thought about this? And I told him to watch this too. I told him this was dropping, so he's probably watching too. I'm about to get you. And we're off. Um, so, because I'm me. That's why. That's why she likes the podcast. That's why she listens to it. She like that I'll keep it 100. Maybe you're not comfortable with yourself. You feel me? If you're not comfortable with yourself. You're, you're a pretty handsome guy. I checked your Instagram out. Pretty fly. Be like, like insecurities, my dude, will destroy you. And is she bad? She's bad business. I don't know her, but I know her from around the way. I'm not going to entertain that because I don't do that. Uh, I've been doing this for a while, and I haven't entertained none of the women that have been in my my DMs or inbox, inbox me. I'm pretty solid with that. Like, I I'm, I know what it's like. I know that I'm a handsome guy. You feel me? I know I'm handsome. But I'm not here for your ladies. I'm not here for your ladies, you clowns, you bozos, you insecure clownies. Um, if I wanted to do that, I could. If, look at this, look at me. I'm looking directly at you, clown. If I wanted her, I could have her number. I can have her. You mad at me because she listens to me. All you gotta do is be a real man and be like, hey, listen to that when I'm not around. But what confuses me and throws me off about you, <clears throat> we're not done, we're still off. You said to me, you like my podcast. You like what I'm doing. I hear this a lot. Would dudes be in their emotions, in their feelings, and they come to me and be like, I don't fucking like you. But I like your podcast. Where they do that at, bro? How you don't like me, but you like my podcast. Oh yeah, and you got some pretty dope videos. But you're a clown. But you're but you but but I'm a fuck boy. I'm fat. I can't dress. I can't do this. But you are a fan. 
Oh yeah, I listened to a couple of your podcasts, bro. They're pretty dope. So why are you in my inbox and my emails harassing me if you're a fan just like your woman? Listen to the podcast with her, blow her back out, smoke some weed, do whatever you want to do, drink some champagne with her, live life, bro, and enjoy the, the enjoy the, the, the festivities of a great podcast. Don't come harassing me because I don't want your woman. If I want a woman, I'm coming for her. I'm going, I, that's just it. If I want your woman, I'm going to come for her. That's it. I can't really clown you because you like my shit. But you just got some insecurities, bro, that you need to address. And next time approach me and don't call me a don't call me a fuck boy. Don't call me fat. Don't call me that. Because guess what? You're a little bit bigger than me, broski. You're about a you're about a burger away from being obese, my dude. You see any double chin action here, brother? Do you see any of that? You're starting to, you're starting to develop. You feel me? I'm in that gym. I'm in a gym. Don't come for me. Come correct. Next bozo. Um, this one, I'm gonna get him good. Approaches me. This is he's been a he's been a, a guy that's been coming around a lot, and I've been telling him, my man, this ain't what you want. I think I sent him the link to Clown Season, Part One. Part Two is coming soon. Don't worry about it. And he was like, "Okay, fuck your podcast. I ain't no clown." I just want to know why you email at my girl. I said, well, I replied back to all fans and your girl seems to be a big fan. She's been a fan for quite some time because she's always emailed me. And I don't even shout her out on some couple emails. You feel what I'm saying? Um, maybe she asked her that. But you keep responding back to her and I seen you leave a heart emoji after one of your emails. Um, I do cater to women. Uh, my podcast is directed towards women, beautiful women, all women, all shapes and sizes, all colors. I love y'all. Ain't no, ain't no discrimination over here. Ain't no discrimination over here with the Michael versus Marvelous podcast, with the Michael versus Marvelous YouTube, and with the LOFM brand. Get it? Ladies love fucking Marvelous. I am him. He is me. Boom. So I laugh at this one. Just, just like <laughs> he was like, I don't like you. I when I see you, I'ma whoop your ass. For one, you don't know where I'm at. And for two, I don't play the threaten things. Because I'm, I got a real, 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 real disrespectful mouth when it comes to men. I don't disrespect women, but I will fuck you up, player, if you ever pull it up. And you know where I'm at, and I know what area you in. I will fuck you up, <laughs> worldly. Don't let this, don't let this fool you. <laughs> don't let this fool you, because guess what? Short man. <laughs> I scooped you out. Weren't you a valedictorian in high school? <clears throat> Bro, not attracted to your woman. Not at all. Um, not my style. Checked her out. I know her. We cool peeps. But I don't want her. You mad. Because you think she wants me. Because she listens to my podcast. It's a free country, bro. Like, all I just gotta do is download the app and just listen. You should be happy. Like I said about the last dude, y'all should be happy that y'all fucking women 
are listening to my podcast in front of y'all. So y'all can see them listening to it. Let's have them going over to the girl's house. Listen to your sure. I know that I have a nice voice. I know it. I know that I carry myself well. But I've been doing this for almost a year and a half. Almost two years, these podcast thing, bro. Two of them. And I ain't never approached none of these women as been with them. Well, it's a lot. Bruh. The Marvelous versus My- the Marvelous Myers one Gmail is lit. The Michael versus Marvelous podcast DMs are lit. And they not even follow me, bro. Like I said, I knock your ass out. Shorty, we don't we don't we don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. Don't make threats to me. Cause I can I can show pull up on you. And I would hate to have to make you a world star victim. I don't want your woman. I can cure I don't care for you. You're bum. You are the definition of the clown. Like I don't get why people get so mad because they women like me. I could see if I was pulling up on them, I was responding back like, hey, we should go to dinner. We should do this. You should let me uh, get in them guts. I ain't saying none of that. I can send a kissy emoji. I can send a heart. I appreciate the love and support. What people don't understand, what you bozos, the clowns don't get. I do it for my fans. That shit keeps me going. I love when I get, oh, I love your podcast. Your voice is so sexy. Oh, your voice does something to me. And see that they posting pictures with you bummy clowns when they making y'all look decent because y'all shouldn't even have these baddies. They shouldn't be on a hand like that. But mwah, you feel me? Because I'm I'm fly. And y'all not. When clowns approach me, I'm going to use this platform to clown you bozos. And like I told you, bozos, all three of you. Come watch, come listen. Cause I guarantee you, part two, I'm saying your names and where you're from and your IG names. Time to expose these bozos to clowns. You don't come for me. You feel me? Like I said, hit that subscribe button if you want to. If you decide to, hit that bell button, turn on all notifications. Swish, Kobe. Uh, you get some of that good content. You be the first to get it. I'm your, I'm the one and only, the Marlis one. I feel Marlis, by the way. And y'all should too. <laughs>